These are the stories of the drive and determination it takes to excel in the toughest sport in the world. This is USA Gymnastics Behind the Team, presented by AT&T. I'm definitely excited to be back here for another Visa Championships. This is it, you know, this is where opportunities open up very big. My goal this weekend is just to get back out there and get that competition feeling back just because it has been a year since I've competed. This is my second competition back since last year, so I'm really looking forward to it. You know, in terms of what do I want out of this competition, I, I want to win the meet. I, I feel like even though I'm not 100%, um, I'm not in Beijing shape, I still feel like I can be the national champion. It's been a while since I've competed, so I just want to come back and just do my best and see what happens. I'll prepare it in the way I've always prepared, you know, whatever. If it's not broken, don't fix it. This is your time to, to get your name out, to get on the national team now, because you don't just make an Olympic team in the Olympic year. You make it in the years preceding the Olympics and into World Championships. Worlds is in the back of my head, but I'll focus on that as soon as this is over. My first Visa Championships was in 2000. It was, it was a long, that was nine years ago. <laughs> You know, my first one was 10 years ago, so I'm kind of feeling a little nostalgic. I remember my first one was in 2002, so kind of a while ago. I think I'm the oldest guy competing in this meet now, 27. So that's, that's a eye-opener. There's definitely a lot of new guys competing, and it is, it is kind of weird for uh, those of us who have been around for a while. You know, you've got new guys like Steve Legendre, Chris Brooks, uh, Danelle Leva. Uh, my hyper routine is at a 17-0 start right now. Apparently it's one of the highest in the world. I'm excited for everyone and it's kind of like a new generation, but also very excited that a lot of the older generation are, you know, still in the mix. There's a lot of talent coming up and the U.S. team would have the ability to be much deeper than we were even in the, in the last quadrennium. Every time we step out onto the floor, we have to concentrate and focus on business and everything. Take a deep breath, salute, focus on what I'm doing, and then I go. It's pretty much time for John Horton to stop getting second and third and, and show that I, you know, I can be the best guy in the country. Uh, I have this skill, it's called uh, jam hop. There's no one else in the world that does it. I'm just really excited to be able to be back out here, especially after the busy year that we've had. From the Olympic Games, like coming back, we definitely are different competitors. Uh, we focus a lot better. I know I do. I love just performing for people and putting it on a show. Great to finally have this title under my belt. The 2009 Visa Championships All-Round Champion, Jonathan Horton! My gymnastics continues to, like, I, I'm always trying to one-up myself. So I'm going to go back, I'm going to review this competition, I'm going to get back and practice, and I'm going to say, how can I make each individual event better? Right now, at this moment, I'm extremely motivated and pumped to get back in the gym and improve even more. The 2009 Visa Championships All-Around Champion, Bridget Sloan! Walking in anywhere after the Olympics, you did have, you know, everybody looked at you different. And now, I mean, I don't know if they'll look at me different, but I'm now not just the Olympian. I'm also Bridget Sloan, the national champion. The 2009 USA Hand Senior National Team. Let's hear it for them. You know, when I look around at the US national team, it's nothing but strengths. I, I don't see any weaknesses. We got a great group of guys that can tumble. We got good guys on palm horse. We got strong guys on rings, vault, parallel bars, high bar. It's going to be, uh, you know, really cool to see what happens. The 2009 USA Senior Women's National Team. I see a very promising future for USA Gymnastics. There's a lot of good talent on the national team right now, which is going to help us in every way, so I'm really excited about it. I'm really proud of every single person out there, and for those that are on, that just made their national team for the first time, live it up, because this is going to be the best 
year or the next few years of their life.